<laughs> what do I think? Yeah. I think you're crazy. I'm trying to figure out why you don't have a damn helmet on, first of all. So, um... <laughs> What's going on here? What's taking yeah. place right here? So, yeah, um, <laughs> it happens. I was so caught up into what I was expecting the car to do, because this right here, what you're looking at is a test pass. Mm -hmm. So on this test pass, I had expectations for a number, um, yeah, pretty much a number, which is the ET, which is the actual time you run in either the eighth or the quarter mile. Mm -hmm. So on this test run, you know, that's all I was really anticipating. I've never, this is this is a big moment. Yeah. That's the first time I ever went down the track without a helmet on. And you were like looking at the playback like, wait a minute, did I have my helmet on? <laughs> the first time I ever went down the track without a helmet on, my mama gonna kill me. Oh my God. But, uh, so, so let's talk about the whole leading up to the race because we have um, those, those clips that we were just speaking on coming shortly, the next um, pass. But when you first get into the car, let's walk them through the process so that way when they actually see it, they know what they're looking at. So you don't actually just get in the car and just drive straight down the track. You actually do what's called a burnout and you get the tires wet first. So let's talk about where the smoking stuff comes from. You where know, when the you're, smoking stuff the comes The smoking from. stuff comes from, yeah. You when get you're, your tires wet. <laughs> uh, so when you get your uh, tires wet, uh, let, me, let me let y'all know what's really going on. Yeah, you know, because the way that I'm explaining it, you know, you're going to break it down for them all the way, you know. But in layman's term, you, they get the tires wet and they make them hot. Yeah, there you go. Tell them. So when you approach the burnout box in your race car mm -hmm. and the burnout box is it's a 20 30 40 it's the 20 to 40 feet area when you first get onto the track and the first two or three feet that you roll through it is going to be some water there you'll see people spraying water from a hose pipe and what you're doing is you're rolling your tires works. yes <laughs> you're rolling your tires through that water once you roll your tires through that water, you know, you make a contact with the rubber of your tires and the water. So once you start to power brake, and power braking is, you put, your, it's like probably how everybody learned how to drive. That's how I learned how to drive. Some people going to lie, but hey, I'm going to keep it a buck. I learned how to drive with two feet, originally. <laughs> I, my foot on the brake with my left foot and my right foot on the gas. Okay. It is what it is. That's how you power brake. You take your left foot and apply it as hard as you can, and then you take your right foot and apply it as hard as you can to the gas pedal, and that then locks your back brakes up and allows you to create a, a, a burnout, which you know is your tires moving at a power brake. Mm. So that's where the smoke comes from. Your car will go up in RPMs. Most people that do a burnout, once that car get in high RPMs, they'll shift to second gear so that it doesn't hurt the motor because if you burn if you if you do a burnout too hard and you go too high in RPMs in first gear then there's a potential that you can hurt the motor right there before you even get a chance to race